three. Honorable judges, respected teachers, and my dear fellows, assalamu alaikum. Today, the topic of my speech is words without actions are mere philosophy. At first glance, it may be confusing because actions can't actually speak, but the impact they hold is exceptional. I must say that, word, that actions speak louder than the words. When I speak of actions, I speak of the accomplishments of the great leaders around the globe. In recent history, if I talk about the great leaders, Qaid e Azam, Muhammad Ali Jinnah, the founder of Pakistan, seems to be the most noteworthy example. He proved himself not by the words, but proved his wisdom and tactics through his actions. It was his actions that helped him in succeeding in building a nation, and it was his actions that impacted the suppressed. I must say that words do not hold the power, actions do. What we say and what we do is totally contrary. Actions are used to elevate a person. People pay more attention to the actions and not the words. Don't just propose a plan, execute it, because actions speak louder than the words. Dear audience, every country dreams of becoming a well-known nation and, uh, and succeed in every aspect. If I talk about progression, Japan seems to be an extraordinary example. The atomic bombs that destroyed the hopes, the civilization, a generation, and a million dreams of a million people, but couldn't manage to destroy their hopes to rise and shine again. They rose from ashes and now have become one of the biggest nations around the globe. All this progress is due to sheer determination and actions. Words provide base and foundation, but the direction is determined through the actions. In modern day, the pandemic affected the whole nation. The situation became crucial. Words didn't come handy, actions did. These were the actions of the scientists that helped in the formation of the vaccines. In a duration of 1.5 years, we overcame the situation. Even this gives an evidence that words are not important as much as the actions are. I would not be wrong if I describe the actions of a holy prophet, Hazrat Muhammad, peace be upon him, who earned the title of Al-Sadiq and Al-Amin through his actions. These were his actions that made even the bitter enemies, the pagan Arabs, who trusted him. I must say that well done is better than well said. Pledge is not enough. Words are not enough. But actions are required to eradicate major problems, such as monarchy, poverty, and climate changes. 